All right, welcome back to the Good Morning Ninja Show. I believe say yes. So now they don't do with me. You now don't they enjoy the whole matter so far because we promised we're not the best of entertainment. And now waiting, we they make sure say we they deliver. Yes, for all of that we don't do with me from the top story segment. On too much for those that we call in contribute. Yes, how they see you now. On do well. And for those we still there with us till now, on get all the level at the hill now. Yes, we they go straight to the first conversation where I promised on today. I talk say we they talk to one better individual, an uh, interior decorator and a uh, balloonist. Yes, uh, everybody talk say ah wait see that one again balloon design who they do that one how did they do that one should not be to just blow balloon hang down well uh this one now another professional on your own level on different levels uh, so when they talk to one better individual will be professional for this field her name now in case i'm going to be speaking to her via skype hello in case you don't join me on top of the show this morning hello good morning good morning in case how are you feeling how are you I'm very good, thank you. <laughs> and how are you today? I'm doing well, I'm doing well. So in, in, in case they, are they always they ask my, my, my guests uh, how they are honestly, because we know there is a coronavirus now, a lot of things don't change, a lot of expectations yeah. don't, you know. So how are you honestly? Are you really good? Yeah, I'm very, very good. And we are protecting ourselves. Okay. We are always covered. Nothing is wrong with us. I like that. <laughs> I like that. I like that. If you say you're protecting yourself, nothing is wrong with you. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, so today we're going to be having a very uh, interesting conversation. Now, uh, event planning and decorations. And you are uh, someone who has been doing this for quite some time now. For first of all, when I was doing the introduction, uh, this, I said a, a, an interior decorator and a balloonist. And people, they wonder, say, ah, Wait to me that. What is a balloonist? Who is a balloonist? Is that a profession? So let's start from there. What uh, is, who is an interior decorator and who is a balloonist? So we go if you understand uh, both and move on. Okay, thank you for this great opportunity. All right. Um, firstly, I would like to say um, interior, um, interior is all about a person into event. Okay. Event uh, event uh, management and the rest but a balloon is, is somebody that is doing a, a better financial mm. rest of it mm. that is a balloon is this. oh so a balloonist is the one who decorates bed days bridal showers yes. things like that yes. oh bed day, photo shows, anniversary all about balloons Okay, so for, for the work of a b b b balloon, it shows that they work with balloons, right? Yes, I am. Okay, okay. So now, let's even see how, 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 how long have you been doing this business, and uh, why did you even decide to get into it in the first place? Okay, um, I've been doing this business for like three, three to four years now. Okay. And, and even before then, I had the passion of, as a, let's say, I, I always needed to learn the, uh, mm -hmm. the balloons of it. Every time, before now, I used to watch it and I'll be like, I they do this thing. I would like to learn this thing. Mm -hmm. So before then, I went to learn it. And after learning it, I'm not a pro in it. So, and in that, my, in that case, I want to showcase my plan to the public. I want to offer I want to also teach other people hmm. in order to know the job. Okay, so you said something about you going to learn about it, get more information. So is it like yeah. uh, you 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 go one school, you went to a school to learn it, or did you like, get a certificate to become a b balloonist or an event de decorator? How do you go about it? Is there a certificate for this? Yes, there is oh. a certificate. I am event planner with a certificate and also a balloonist um, with also a certificate. Mm. So, that is okay. Right. so okay, so there's always a process. It's not like I can just wake up today and say I want to blow a balloon and put it somewhere and say mm -hmm. I'm a balloonist. You know, no, there's, be, be... Always, there's, there's, um, there's always a process. Mm. You, 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 you know that most times, most times, if you want. Let's say if you want to learn it, maybe maybe on phone, it might not be really possible like that. Yeah. So and the first thing as we need the the face to face. Face to face. Order learning. To yeah. Hmm. In order to grab. 
So now, let's even look at events. Let's look at events, uh, the, the decoration now. We know that in Nigeria, before COVID-19, uh, we can say that okay. we are one of the major event country. We, they do events. People, they turn up. There's always one event or the other to attend. And for someone yeah. who is in, in that industry, uh, how, what would you say has been the most uh, difficult part of being an event decorator in Nigeria? What has been one of the challenges where they face? Okay, the major challenge is the COVID-19. COVID-19. During the COVID-19, they on suspend. Yeah. So it was really, really difficult. And we were trying at least to maintain our clients. Always trying to check up on them and know that everybody is open. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, so, so, so that was one of the major issues. Now, it, it, yeah. a, lot of, a lot of people say that sometimes money is also an issue when it comes to event planning, that the people who want to run the event don't give the event planners a lot of uh, enough money to plan the event, but they want perfect, they want a perfect event. Has that ever happened to you? Yeah, it has been happening, but most times uh, we try to work on budget, okay. on the clients, uh, uh, on the budget. So if you need maybe as in a while, make sure that at least budget is okay, you know. But if the person does not have maybe as in enough, and we are going to work based on your budget. Mm -hmm. So so yeah. Um, so I, if I have a small budget and I show you, okay, oh, now the budget where I get with this, you can advise me on how I can carry out with, uh, I can achieve with that amount of, of, of budget, right? Yeah, yeah. So um, the other thing is that most times, as in, I will try to do other to satisfy the client. Okay. Other to, as in, another person. Mm -hmm. Because most times, it is not really about the money, but how to get at that person after that job that you did. Hmm. Okay, so, so, that's, uh, so it's about satisfying the client so that what will come after, the referrals they can, they can bring from this uh, previous job you've done. Okay, yes, so yes. now at any point in time, we're looking at events now um, happening in this COVID-19, and some of the events yeah. are small, small, small. Some of them are online. Do you, have you been able to do uh, events, uh, the decorations for the kind of events that are happening now? Has that, has that been any case for you? Yes, I've been doing, I've been doing some time balloon for people, um, for Zoom uh, birthday and all that. So most times I'll just go to the house, do the decoration and leave. Mm -hmm. Not, uh, um, let's say, their the party. Yeah, on Zoom. Okay, okay. So it's been yeah. uh, you've been you would probably go there, do what you can, and uh, the small g g g gatherings are the ones you've been uh, been able to uh, decorate recently. Okay, so yeah. let's even get a bit more in depth in the balloon decoration because a lot of people still feel that it is just about putting the, the, the balloons. balloons together and just hanging them. So. There is, there, is, there is a creative process uh, behind it, right? How do you come about the, 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 the designs, the styles? How do you come about that? Okay, in this work, it's good to be creative. Because if you're creative, um, okay, like, I will have to be different from others. Now, I will need to do a different thing from what others are doing. Mm -hmm. So... Always say, oh, na balloon, or maybe na balloon balloon. Na balloon balloon, eh eh, na balloon balloon. Yes, na balloon balloon. So it takes a process, and um, I have, I we have um, um, electric form. Mm -hmm. We have, um, um, and we have also, a, and we have a gas. Okay. For, for to, balloon yeah okay. so it is not just a balloon and in balloon there are different qualities balloons but some people they don't and they'll just say ah i just uh, na ordinary balloon mm -hmm. not like that mm -hmm. so they are qualities so it is we that are that knows that oh, this is the quality that can um, let's say your event mm -hmm. okay 
that's it. So, so that is why we come back to say, okay, at this time, that even Jesus Christ, he did not, he did not do it all by himself. Mm -hmm. That is why he, that is why that Jesus Christ gave he owned a, uh, I, I'm sorry, he, um, the disciples. The disciples, he, yeah. To the work. So that is why we are coming to tell you that at this time, don't depend on just your job. Going to school doesn't mean that you're going out to have at the let's say uh, let's say at the office or that. So it is time to make use of your come out and learn. Mm -hmm. So because most times and we do have some challenges that maybe at the, anybody that lives maybe at the mm -hmm. let's say Aja mm -hmm. and they may say oh I need to by six o'clock and I'll be like oh. That's I not be okay. So at least if we have to have, let's say, other, uh, okay, let's say, uh, other, other axes. Yeah. Maybe at that time uh, we can say, oh, go to the place and and, uh, and do the job. Mm -hmm. So now people are feeding this, but the people, um, but the people that do it, mm -hmm. just where well, we are coming out with other, in order to know how. To so, so it's it's a it's a kind of job that uh, you actually hire other uh, people to do with you. Or do you do do you always handle it by yourself when you're doing uh, this? You're um, doing this creation. Do you handle these things alone, or do you get to hire people to also do this job with you? Yeah, I get to hire people to with me. Like now, I have people with me because there is no way you are going to work all alone. So if you happen to go there and be working, your client is not going to see you like, oh, they were like, ah, this was what you're going to do as the us be alone. Mm -hmm. How do you manage to do this thing all alone? So it's not a person, uh, it's mm -hmm. not just for uh, a particular person. Okay. A collective. It's a collective effort. It's actually a collective yeah. effort. So let's even look at now that the fact that you decided to get into this, uh, this industry, it's, it's, it's not like it's a new industry, but a lot of people didn't know that being a balloonist is a profession on its own. You know, they felt, okay, everything is under interior decoration now. Uh, if I want the decoration, you go give me balloon, we go blow them, we go hang them. You go give me a ribbon, I go cut them, I go put them for here. So they didn't know, people don't know that it's uh, a different form of a profession of its own. So can you say that someone who is an interior de decorator can, uh, must know how to do the, the balloons or you can be an interior decorator and not a, a balloonist at the same time. Do you think that's possible? Yeah, very, very possible. Hmm. So I can, I can I, I, yes. Okay, sorry. Okay, no, go ahead, go ahead. Okay, it is very, very possible because I've been doing that before now. Okay. I've decorated for somebody's wedding and also, and the best thing we did, the best thing we did ask me to put the balloon as well. So mm -hmm. because I know it, and I know how to do them. That is why it is easy to manage that too. So, being an event plan, also a balloon, I think is easy for, for the person because if you want to do only the, only the, the planning, and at the end, uh, you're going to look for, let's say, uh, let's say for the balloonist yeah. as well. Yeah. So, like this, uh, so like that, let's say if you have to not have to do the two at the same time, it will be easier be for easier. you. And you won't have to spend more money, right? <laughs> Employing somebody else to do it. Now, yeah, I, looking right. at some of the pictures that have been flashing by, I see very, very creative ways you play with the balloons. And from the pictures we've been seeing, very creative ways you've yeah. been playing with the balloons. But has there been any time that you give a client a charge and the, tell, the person will tell you, uh -uh, not the only ordinary balloon, why am I spending so much just for balloons? <laughs> When that happens, <laughs> what do you tell them? How do you go about that? When that happens, I will try to make them that, that different qualities of. Yes. So if you are not 
as in the higher the higher grade mm -hmm. they help them sit down in order in to keep as in relationship with our friends. Mm -hmm. But uh, I remember one time I work for I work for law law. Okay. So and she did not really argue. Although that person she was like, ah, okay, say, do you want to kill me? So no. I have to explain to her. I say, ah, mama, like this, like this. And she now see the reason. I say, okay. And she had to pay a uh, amount. So I uh, happy, you know. <laughs> so, so I would like to ask her uh, on a lighter note, do you really make good money from being just a balloonist? Or does the bulk of the money come from being an event planner and also being uh, a, 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 a balloonist added? I would like to know, can you, just, can you make good money being just that one alone than being an event planner and uh, being uh, someone who handles the balloons? Okay. Being an event planner, Sometimes that is not really, uh, let's say, all, all the time. Or for balloon, every time people are doing the bridal shower, yeah. they photo uh, baby shower, and all that. So that one is every week, like that, like that, every week. Oh. It, it's possible to have, like, meanwhile, for normal events, they take, maybe a, they take a while. Like, or two months, or or like that. Yeah. So the balloon is really putting money, like ah. all this. I guess it. For this thing you have said, I'm going to learn how to blow balloon today. Eh? So balloon is every so, week. It's coming in every week. <laughs> I'm going to start yes. blowing balloon from today. After this show, you will see me blowing balloons. Well, it's you good have that to go, my name. <laughs> I have to learn. All right, all right. Well, the, it's good that we're having this conversation so that people can understand that there are various okay. kinds of uh, interior decoration and the various ways you can make, yeah. you know, a profession out of it. But in case people want to follow you on top social media, because I know that uh, th this is a skill that is quite new and people are still wondering, that, okay, being a, a balloonist on its own, uh, okay, maybe I need to look into the art and see what it's all about. So, how can they follow you on social media uh, to see, uh, you know, more information on this your uh, on this balloonist uh, profession? How can they follow you on social media? Okay, my name on Instagram is Missy Balloon Deco at Missy Balloon Deco. Missy Balloon Deco. Yeah, they're on Facebook page uh, Missy Balloon Deco. Okay, okay. So, Missy yeah. Balloon Decor. Okay. Yeah. All right. So, since we decided to introduce this new side of the profession into the business, balloon decorations, I'm going to make sure I will start blowing balloons from today. As you don't talk, I'm saying, now yeah. bring more money. It's the one that is bringing more money. Abby, yeah. don't worry. I will yeah. follow you on social media and I will get all the information I need to know regarding this new it's prayer terrible. business. No wahala. That's Missy yeah. Balloon Decor on Instagram and on Facebook, yeah. Missy Balloon Decor, right? Yeah. All right. Thank and you. And also, yeah. our training is coming up next week on the 3rd to, to 5th. Okay. Next okay. week, on Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Our training is coming up. Yeah. All right. No wahala. No wahala. No wahala. No wahala. So uh, I would probably for a follow up and uh, check out the social media page for the guys who are interested in balloon decoration. Yes, it's a new profession and like she said, Tokam, very lucrative. I'm thinking. Baboon. Okay. Nkese, thank you very much for talking to me this morning and uh, hoping that this new profession way we did talk about so a lot of Nigerians go see him as lucrative business and took hand inside. Thank you for your time.